And we're back with our let's play of uh, Grim Fandango Remastered. Gladys was sick from not having the uh, ability, to not having a car to work on or whatever. So, uh, and we also had to retrieve tickets, the golden ticket that was stolen from the people from the, the early uh, operation. Or what, not the early, yeah, yeah, okay, well, uh, so we solved the problem of A, finding the tickets, and B, reviving Gladys by C, getting here really freaking fast. And some, and apparently we got a gift. Joy. Those dominoes are like one long fuse. I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. I'm not setting foot. I don't think my hands are steady enough for that. Good boy. Poor guy, so nervous. I think he's gonna be sick. Don't panic. <laughs> Not right now. All right, what to do in good old Rubicava? That goes to the upper dock, but nothing's docked there now. It's locked, but there's nothing up there anyway. That goes to the upper dock, but nothing's docked there now. Eh. Maybe is it Maximino's cat track or something? I don't know. That's the folding bridge that connects this pier to the base of the cat track, where at least it used to. <laughs> Maintenance has gotten pretty lax around here, apparently. Hmm. Still got the dirigible. What else is here? Wonder if the tattoo guy ever got his uh, shipment of nitri nitrous liquid nitrogen. Never get me under that thing. I don't want to wake up Toto. You asked for I don't want to wake up Toto. I think these are binders of tattoos. I don't want to wake up Toto. It's a little cabinet. You asked for Bunny. Never Stop get me moving. under that thing. There can't be too much in here. I better save it. Liquid nitrogen, not to be used on bone. Doesn't hurt. I wonder if Inez has cooled off yet. Hello, operator? Yeah, it's me, Manny. I was just passing through town and... You asked for Bunny. Wow. Still mad. You gotta respect that, I guess. We're only glitched for like three years. Like, that's the kind of petty I wish I was. That would make things fun. Or at least funny. Hey, MJ. Poor guy. So nervous. I think he's gonna be sick. What a trooper. Looks like Domino left his calling card. But how? I saw him torn to shreds. He must have done this on his last trip through town. Not right now. <laughs> Charming. Hey, Captain. Manuel Calavera? Ha ha ha! Well, what happened to the limbo? Hate to tell you, Velasco. But she went down at the Pearl, but we found a new ship, the SS La Mancha, and managed to... The La Mancha? Uh, my old rusty bucket. Where is she? Oh, well, we traded her in Puerto Zapato for a team of sled dogs. That does it. I'm out of this stinking mob town. But... Thanks for finding my baby, Manny. Puerto Zapato, here I come. Mob town? You'd think after two years, he'd have the little SS Lumbago's lifeboats on, at least. Maybe I'll just finish this for him. You'd think after two years, he'd have the little SS Lumbago's lifeboats on, at least. It's locked. It's locked. Not picking that up. Okay. Good to know. 
Well, I hope Captain's having fun. Quest of a lifetime or something, I don't know. Well, not a lifetime per se, but... Due to the new curfew, elevator operation ceases at sunset. Curfew? Who's in charge of this place now? It's locked. Not picking that up. What a oh, that guy. Blue casket. Just doesn't have the zing of Calavera Calf. Blue casket. It's attached pretty well. Where is everybody? One of these days I'm going in there. Calavera, what are you doing here? I heard you went pow in Zapato, Daddy. Well, Hector Lamont's tried and missed. Now it's my turn. I'm headed to El Maro to put him out of business. Manny, that place has changed. You don't know what you're getting into. I'd better come with you. Just give me a minute to get ready. Okay, but if you hear a loud explosion anytime soon, the trip's off. Ooh, smells like this door leads to the kitchen. What in tarnation? Coffin shooter one, two, three, just pour, chill, and serve. I would, but I hate sucking gelatin straight from the tap. I don't need the hernia. <laughs> hmm. Well, it is a bottle. I suppose glass could use them to take the edge off. That's what the lumbago diorama needed. Fake ocean water. <laughs> That's what the lumbago diorama needed. Fake ocean water. Okay. Not a lot of work at the port, it seems. Hmm, not a good sign for Rubicaba's organized labor movement. Hello, Terry? Not picking that up. <sighs> this place again. Getting the bone wagon out of here. But, uh, yeah. Poor guy, so nervous. I think he's gonna be sick. What's that? It's, uh, lumbago lemonade. Try it. Mmm. Perkly little aperitif, actually. <laughs> yes, siree. Not bad, tall. <laughs> Tell me where you got that right now! Olivia's kitchen. Lumbago lemonade! Manny, aren't we in a hurry? Don't worry. This won't take long. Stomach don't stretch like it used to. Oh, Gladys. He looks like he's about to blow, too. So, what is that stuff they pack can hams in anyway? Ugh, 
good show, my friend. You wouldn't happen to have a breath mint on you, I suppose. Looks better. Feels better. Make a gel. Hey, I made it spill. The rest is up to you. Looks better. Feels better. What a trooper. You really should get back in case it blows. I'm with you guys till the end. You know that. Nasty. It's not gelling. It can't gel now. It got all nice and warm in my belly. Whatever. We'll do it the old fashioned way. Well, new fashioned way, technically. Don't think they had liquid nitrogen in the old days. Hey, good idea! I bet I could keep it down now that it's cold. Just let me get across first, okay? Squishy. Yes. Well, that's just. Uh... A parade of bones trapped in a suspended state. Kind of a metaphor for all of us, really, if you think. Just defuse the bomb, Manny! Okay, okay, okay. Fiendish. Soon to be known as the Blown Wagon. Hey, that's not funny! Soon to be known as the Blown Wagon. Hey, that's not funny! Yeah, I thought it was a different voice line. Okay, whatever. I'd better disarm her first. Well, let's do some light fingers or whatever, just like, like, a, like a thief in the night. Well, here goes nothing. Jackpot. Looks like Hector's taken over the whole town. He hasn't had much resistance. There's only one small group who oppose him, and they live out on the fringes of the city. Places like this, you mean? I hope they're not hurting Gladys. Ha. Huh. Shows what you know about this group. Their leader is a great man who... Manuel Calavera, we meet again. I see you have found what you were looking for. How fortunate for you to arrive now just as we too are about to achieve success. Our army has grown, and right now our top agents are in Hector's weapons lab, about to close in on the enemy in his own den. I couldn't have done it without you, Manuel. It was a trap! Stand back. There's only one thing to do. You have saved me, but more than that, you have enabled me to continue to serve the movement. What did you say about a trap? Hector uncovered our agent in his weapons lab. No. You idiot Bowsley! Your new lab assistant is a spy! Haven't you ever heard of a background check? No time to explain. Now I'll have to take matters into my own hands. Take me with you. I've longed to be of service to your cause for years. dramatic. We'll be back next time.